Hello and welcome to the demo of Data Masking Tool. The tool has a macro enabled Excel which generates a reusable Java transformation that can be imported in Power Center Designer and then can be used in any mapping of user's choice. This is the Excel sheet. It consists of two tabs. First is the General Details tab where we have to give the repository and folder details, the owner name of the folder and the destination path where the final transformation XML is to be produced and the name of the transformation. In the configuration tab we have to provide the name of the columns, which masking algorithms to use for each column and the other details necessary to mask the columns and generate the transformation. Also we have the option of generating a masking transformation or an unmasking transformation. The unmasking transformation is only useful for reversible masking algorithms. This means that the original data can be reproduced from the masked data given the masking details. I have a mapping already imported here. This is the masking demo mapping. The source has six columns which I have already configured in the Excel sheet template. I am trying to mask my first column using fixed list the second using Visionaire, the third using Hash, the fourth date shift, and so on. The details for each masking algorithm can be found in the user guide. In the general details tab, this is the folder we want to import the reusable transformation in. Now this is the destination path where we want to generate the transformation XML. I copy it from here and paste it. Save the sheet and then click here to generate the masking transformation. This is the generated XML. Sorry, here. This is the generated XML. All I need to do now is to import it in designer. Next. I'll replace the transformation because it's already present in the folder. We get a warning here, but we shouldn't worry about it. All we need to do is to compile the Java code and save it. And the transformation is ready to use. I'll refresh the mapping for this session. And save it. Now going to the server. This is the source that we'll be using. This is the data, the various columns that we're going to use. The first column will be masked using fixed list. The second by Visionaire and so on. My target folder is the same as the source folder. Now I'll execute the workflow. Now this is the target that was generated. Now the first one got masked using fixed list. Mukund changed to Rahul. And Rohit changed to Shyam. The second one was Visionaire, the third is Hash, the fourth was Date Shift. We have shifted it by a year as mentioned here. The masking key was MM12, so that means we want to shift it by a year. Now this is the random values being generated and here the first three are replaced by default values as mentioned here. 